December 2019, the coronavirus was first transmitted from animals to humans in Wuhan, China. Then the Chinese people went about their daily lives, unaware that they were transmitting the virus by doing simple things like shaking hands and fist bumps. And then they went home to eat dinner with their families, to spread the virus amongst them to not knowing they were sick, Many took business trips across the world. Some took vacations and started the spread of coronavirus around the world. In many parts of the world, the cases doubled each day because people did not know they were sick. After China, Italy was hit hard, and then it came to the United States. stop the spread, we were told to stay six feet apart, called social distancing. In our home state of Maryland, our governor, Governor Hogan, closed schools on March 16 and closed non-essential businesses on March 23rd. Coronavirus attacks your lungs and makes it hard to breathe. In most cases, your immune system gets rid of the coronavirus. Unfortunately, many cases become severe. Epithelial cells have died, and with them the lung's protective lining. Therefore, the alveoli of the lungs can be affected by bacteria. Victims get pneumonia, and breathing is very hard or stops. Then, people need ventilators. If too much bacteria grows, it can be fatal. Thankfully, Doctors and nurses all around the world work around the clock to save many lives. And other people are doing their part to sew masks. While others are using their fame to encourage us at home. All this, we here at SGN have covered the fight from the heroism of the brave men and women on the front lines to the undeniable power of the human spirit exhibited by each and every one of you week in and week out, right from your very own homes. But you know what? It's okay if you've asked yourself every now and again, what is all this for? Because this week, we got a sneak peek at the answer. Though we are by no means out of the woods on this thing, we now know there's light at the end of the tunnel. This is what it looks like when you leave LIJ, COVID positive, discharge to health. Here in Maryland, things are finally starting to improve. Our hope, though, is in Jesus. <laughs>